kids welcome back to bubble pop kids so so many of you have been asking me to do like a back to school haul with all of the cutest school supplies so i went to the dollar tree and i found tons and tons of the cutest things ever i actually got so many cool deals at the dollar tree for back to school i filled two bags there are so many things so i have this bag and i'm gonna put the second bag in another video and do part two of this back to school haul you guys see we get part one started everything in this video is gonna come out of this bag you are gonna love this stuff i think i spent 20 or 30 dollars i got so many things here time to review let me just dump this out and And here it is. Look at all of these cool finds. Now this is just the first bag. I'm gonna do the second part of the haul tomorrow. I have probably just as many things in that one. These are just the ones I'm gonna put for today. There's so many of them, so inexpensive. I love, love, love the Dollar Tree. I never knew they had so many cool school supplies. What do you guys see? We look at this stuff one at a time and see how cute it is. Let's do it. We are starting with the folders. These are so, so cute. They had so many different kinds. I'm gonna do two different folders I got today and in my next haul, I'm gonna do a few more. I bought so many. <laughs> so here we have these. This is super adorable. Look at the zebra print. It's got little peace sign, hearts and stars. And then there's kind of like a hologram in the middle. It also comes with another one. Let's open them. I also found these little cuties. And you get two folders for a dollar in one pack. That's just super amazing. <laughs> Sometimes folders can be almost $2 each. Woo! Okay, so here's the first one. I am just in love with this. <laughs> I really love it so, so much. It's got all the zebra print. It's got the three holes for your binder. Here is the other one. And if you look, it's got the hologram in the middle. Just so, so detailed. Boop. Those are awesome. Now onto these. Oh, this is like a little bear or something like that. These are paper. Kind of like a cardboard material, but these are plastic ones. Let's get a closer look at these. Oh, and they're called pocket buddies. I have to say they look kind of babyish, but they are just so, so cute. I would use them. <laughs> I don't care. They're like a really good plastic material. And when you open them, all the little bear faces in there. You could put all your homework and paper. So cute. So you get two of those, two of these. How can you go wrong? I spent $2 on four of these. Next up, ooh, I love this. I found this 2016-17 student planner. Look how cute it is. It kind of matches that black folder with the little hearts and peace signs. And this is perfect for putting all your homework assignments in here, or you could put like your, whatever school schedule you have if you're doing sports. Got so many colorful pages. It goes all the way from August to, what does it go to? It goes all the way until, ooh, July 2017. So it'll cover you for the whole year. And at the beginning of every month, you get like a monthly calendar. So good to keep track of all the things you're doing at school. Love it. This was only a dollar. Now, these next three things I want to show you kind of together as a set because they are so super adorable. I can't even take it. <laughs> they all have the same little design going, so I found this mini notebook. I love these for just like doodling and taking little notes. You wouldn't really use this for homework or anything. It's kind of a chunky fat book and it's got that adorable little star on there. Then I found the matching pencil case. Can <laughs> you believe this? It's the exact same pattern. This was only a dollar. Ooh, and I think there's actually two in here. You get one with stars, you get a blue one. So you get like this little one here. You can actually put makeup in here, lip glosses, pencils, anything you like. And it also comes with just like a plain blue one. It's a little bit bigger. Maybe you can put your calculator and ruler and stuff in here. Just too, too much. I don't know where else you would find something so cute for so cheap. <laughs> I'm in love with that. And it also came with a matching composition book with the same stars. Now this you can definitely use in school for your homework. So I got the whole set and these only costed three bucks. I found some multi-purpose clips. We have a six pack here. These are really good for anything. When you have those big stacks of worksheets, you can clip them together. I just loved all the different colors. They're super, super cute. Take a closer look. You get it like a black, turquoise blue. Ah! You get an orange, green, red, and purple. These 
are just so colorful. You can keep these. Woo! You can keep them in your locker or you can put them in your little pencil case. And whenever you have a large stack of papers, you just pop them together. I really, really like these. Moving on to my favorite things besides the lip gloss and Shopkins, I love pens. I am obsessed with stationery. I have so many different cute little pens. These ones are amazing. They're actually fruit scented. They are jelly pens. And I wonder if they have different colors. I'm not sure. Fruit scented ink. We get grape, blueberry, and strawberry. I was just amazed how these were only a dollar because when I've seen these in other stores, they're really expensive. <laughs> So let's take a closer look. Oh, how amazing are these? They have like little grapes on that one. Little strawberry pictures, blueberries, and I love how they have whoop, that comfort grip on there so you don't hurt your finger when you're doing so much writing. How about we test them in our little star notebook? Perfect, that is so, so colorful. So here is the grape one. Ooh, and it is, it's in purple ink. These aren't the best for doing homework and on tests, but for just doodling and writing notes to your friends, they are perfect. So colorful. It smells so good. It smells just like grapes. <laughs> that is such a super bright color. They're really smooth writing. I could smell it all day. It smells like candy. Here's the next one up, and I'm loving this super neon pink. Look at those strawberries. That looks like a photograph. Such a cool picture. And I'm sure it's going to be hot pink. Yes, it is. Look at that cool color. Mm. It kind of smells exactly the same as the grape. It smells fruity and really sweet. Your homework is going to smell awesome. And we get the blueberry one. Ooh, that's a really pretty blue. Not your regular blue color pen. It's kind of like an aquamarine. Mm. They all smell the same. <laughs> but they smell delicious. So you get your fruit pens. Three of those were only a dollar. And of course I found some more. I have some more pens. Well, actually these are highlighters. They are so cute. Oh, you guys look at this one. It kind of matches exactly to our notebook. It's got that same star print on there. And this even matches the little folder we have. Love those. We also get these three. What do they say? Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Hmm. They're little message pens. They are so cute as well. They have these cool colors. They look really fancy. I couldn't believe these were only a buck. These were only a buck. Let's open them and take a closer look. Here we go. And in my other Dollar Tree that I'm doing tomorrow, I have so many more pens, you won't even believe it. <laughs> There's just too, too many. We're gonna fill up those pencil cases. Oops, here we go. So these are the message pens. Ooh, they're super light. They're really, really light. I thought they were metal, but they're just like a plasticky material. This one is Shitta. It's like a purple and green. And this is Woulda with a green and purple. Uh, no, a blue and purple. And a blue and green. It says Coulda. Let's test them. I think they're black ink. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. They are black, perfect for doing your homework and tests. Ooh, I love these. Really smooth writing, super pretty, and really lightweight. And for our little highlighters, when I first saw these, I thought they were like Sharpie markers, but I was so excited when I saw they were highlighters, just because you can use them all the time. When you're studying for a test, or you're going through your textbooks, look at these. <laughs> They're just too, too cute for words. It's got the coolest print on there. This one has these little butterflies. And this one matches my pencil case and my little notebooks. Love those stars. Of course, we gotta test these. I think they're all different colors. So this one is yellow. Really bright. And the pink one. Ooh, love those little butterflies. They have little polka dots. Cutest designs on these. And this one kind of looks like a green. Yep, three different colors. Perfect. So as you can see, I really hit the jackpot with pens, highlighters, we got some colored pens. So many different ones here. 
I also found some erasers. Love these. This one is huge. It's like 10 times the size of a regular eraser. And look how cute it is. Oops. They had so many different ones. I got a couple more I'm going to show you in the next haul. They have all different colors, different sayings. And this will probably last you for like two years. And maybe even three. There's so many mistakes you can erase with those. This one is a three pack. These are just so, so pretty. Look at these little hearts. When I first saw these, I thought they were mini notebooks. So I don't know why, they kind of look like paper. But then I realized they were just these adorable little erasers. They're too pretty, I don't even want to use them. <laughs> you could just keep them for show in your pencil case. Oh, I like this one with the little stripies. And we get this purple and blue one. Whoop. Love all three of them. And I took the wrapper off of the big oops one. Would you look at this thing? I think it's like two pounds, super heavy. It's gonna erase for a long time. I don't know if I would keep this one in my pencil case. It's just too huge, but I probably keep it on my desk. You can keep it in your locker at school. These ones are more for the pencil case. I also found some color changing mood lip balm. Can you believe this, you guys? I have never seen anything like this at the Dollar Tree. I was so shocked. I actually got two more. I got a little cow and a piggy. I'm gonna show you those in my other haul. But look at this. It's got a before and after color and it's cotton candy flavored. Take a look at this. Oh, look at this little ducky. It's just too, too cute for words. When I saw this, I just went crazy. They are the cutest little sheep. They're kind of like a square sheep. Oop, let's pop the top. So I guess it's pink and then it turns purple. Let's try it. Mmm, that smell like cotton candy. It smells like maple syrup. And it's super smooth. It's not even like a regular lip balm. It's got a lot of like a glossy texture to it. I put some on my hand here. It's like a light pink. It would give you kind of a pink shimmer. Oh, it smells so good. I wish you guys could smell this. But I don't see it turning. Maybe when you keep it on your lips for a little while, it turns purple. Gotta test that out later. And I can't wait to show you the two other ones in my next video. They are called Moody's. Boop. How can you go back to school without a ruler? And I found it. They had so many different rulers at the Dollar Tree. This one is kind of like a 3D design. It's got all of these neon hearts. And look at that. <laughs> it's a hologram. It's just, it's too cool. I couldn't believe this was only a dollar. And it's even better because on the back you have all of your multiplication tables here. So you can memorize those. Once you remember these, you remember them for life. <laughs> you will memorize them. Here they are. I just love this. Let's get a closer look. Woo! All these little hearts floating around. It says love in there. It's kind of mesmerizing. I could like stare at this all day. Ooh, these are kind of different. When I saw these, I thought they were a four pack of like paint brushes, but then I saw it said brush pens. <laughs> what is this? I've never seen anything like that. Are they like markers? Let's try them. They look so cool. Here they are. We get a green, blue, yellow, and red, all the primary colors. And these are just such a funky little thing to have in your pencil case. Let's test them out on our notebook, see what they're gonna do. We'll try the green one, and I love how it really does have the shape of like a paintbrush. Here's the tip. Ooh, <laughs> look at that. These are amazing, I can't even describe it. Here's the tip of the marker. It's kind of like a marker, kind of like a paintbrush. It's super smooth. That is just amazing. I wish they had other colors. I've never written with anything like this before. Here's the yellow one. It feels like you're painting with watercolors, yet it's dry. It's too, too cool. Here's the red one. It has the like smoothest writing tip I've ever seen. I can't believe these were a dollar. And we get the blue one. A little blue, looks like confetti. Oh, I love these. I gotta go back and get a couple more packs just to keep them. They're just amazing. You gotta go try these. Four for only a dollar. I don't 
don't write like a pen, they don't write like a marker, they are a mix between a really smooth marker and a watercolor. I found a couple more little goodies to pop in your backpack going back to school or even your pencil case. So the first one, I was really surprised to find these. They're kind of neat, they're Elmer's glue brand and they're these little washable glue pens. They're not your traditional glue sticks, they're just like regular, like the big tube, just in this tiny little stick. That's tiny, they're super adorable, look at them. And they're called school glue pens, they really do look like pens. Here we go, just see. And it's just like the regular white glue in this cute little convenient package. These are awesome. Found some pencils, because we haven't opened those yet, but in my next haul, I think I probably have like a hundred different pencils. In this one, I just wanted to show you these. They are so cool because they're like velvet. They kind of feel like fluffy baby Shopkins. They're super, super fuzzy. Let me show you. Here they are, so we get two yellow, we get two orange, a green, pink, blue, and a red. And I wish you could feel the texture. They are just super, super fuzzy. I don't know how they made these. They're so comfortable for writing at school. They're so fashionable too. <laughs> they don't look like the plain old yellow pencil. These are probably the most comfy pencils I've ever seen. They're just so fuzzy. They're like writing with a little sweater. I love how they kind of have that zebra or animal print on there. Just love them. Can't go back without some labels. Here we go, I found these Finding Dory ones. How cute are these? Just to put you on your notebook or your textbook, look at all of these ones. We get Hank, Dory and Nemo. So many of them, you get like those bigger ones, you get tiny ones. These are good for folders, like math, science, social studies, just labeling all the different categories. Here we get some more of those big ones. You could put them on, where else could you put them? You can even put them on some of your school supplies, like your pencil box. Love them, there's 52 labels, this was only a dollar. Good deal. Coming to the end of this haul before I start putting everything away and organizing it. This here was too, too much. These little emoji decorative tapes. Look at these. I don't think you would use these for like taping things together. You could just decorate your textbooks with them. Oh, look at that. Pop them in your pencil case, keep them in your locker. Really, really cute. Here's the first one, and I love it because it's pink. It's pink with those little yellow emoji faces on there. And this is what the tape actually looks like. You could wrap these around your pens to kind of decorate them. You could do anything with this. <laughs> it's just kind of like sticker tape. Here's the second one. Ooh, this one is super cute too. It's got like a black background, and it's got little mini emoji faces on there. Look at that. <laughs> This would go so cute against like a pink or purple notebook. Oh, there it is. I like both of them. Here it is, the last little tree in part one of my Dollar Tree back to school haul. Would you look at this? It's just like a little pen and stationery organizer. You could put it on your desk. You could put it in your locker. You can keep your scissors, ruler, everything in there and it was only a buck. I just love this orange color. I usually pick pink, but I like this one. Let's see how our little goodies fit in here. I think I would leave this on my desk, but it is super cute for like a locker. So I love these. These are my favorite things in this entire haul. These kind of marker brush pens. They were just so smooth writing. You could pop those. You can put in our little fuzzy pencil. They add so much color to this. And our fruit smelly pens. You know, these little clicker ones, such a variety. <laughs> I don't think you'll ever use all of these, but they're just so cute to look at. You have your little highlighters here with those cute little graphics. I even think you could stick a glue stick in there and you're good to go. You can also put some of the supplies in these cute little pencil cases. I just love this one. It kind of reminds me of a makeup bag. And you can pop your little lip balm in there so your lips don't get chapped. You can put your cute little paper clips, put a little glue in there, and your erasers. Ah! 
And in the bigger one. Ooh, I know what you could put in there. Your little emoji tape. And your, oops, the biggest eraser I've ever seen. And boom, we get a table filled with the most adorable school supplies. You know, I really don't even think I spend $20 on all this stuff. So many cute things from folders to pens, highlighters. Love this little planner here, tons of erasers. We even got lip balm. And stay tuned tomorrow because I'm gonna be doing my part two where there's even more. Well, we're gonna have so many more fun videos coming up on the show. This is Bubble Pop Kids. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day, bye.